Hello everyone, Alien Volt here, and I'm excited to show you the inside of my hangar for Robert Space Industries Star Citizen Squadron 42. This is my ship. It's a Hornet F7C S Ghost, which is basically like a stealth fighter. Designed to get in and out of places, co-op missions, intel gathering, recon type things. And I can't wait to fly it. Right now the only thing I can do is actually get inside of it. Show you the cockpit. Look at the instrument panels. The game is created on the CryEngine 3, which is the same as Crisis 3. And the game is basically being designed to look two to three times better than Crisis 3, which is hard to imagine because Crisis 3 is just an amazing looking game. But the goal for this game is basically to make it look as realistic as Avatar the movie. I am so excited to fly this jet, or rather spacecraft. I've actually never played a flight simulator at all before. The closest thing to flying that I've done is uh, Battlefield 3 and 4, but I'm willing to learn. The concept of this game just being an interactive universe with millions of people, you know, doing different types of jobs and questing and interactions, a living economy that doesn't require any outside uh, real money to fund. Everything's perfectly able to be earned and in-game. This is your hangar you can customize. I guess you can put little trophies and stuff over there on that shelf. This is my civilian attire versus my flight suit and then a giant aquarium that I could put fish into. A TV monitor displaying the different ships that are available in the game. And the way the game works is basically you sign up now and pledge an amount to help support the, the cost of designing the game. And you get your ship in your hangar now where you can come in and play around and look at it, see what you're actually going to be using in the game. I've never seen a game do that ever before. And then you're guaranteed alpha and beta testing with the game. Um, this is an interactive panel that um, basically when you buy parts for your ship and upgrades, everything's kind of stored here and by selecting the items on this panel, you're able to remove parts and put parts on uh, by operating the panel. Now this is a weapon and I'm not 100% positive that this is just a weapon simulator or an actual weapon that goes on my ship. Now I know my ship's capable of putting a big cannon on top of it which isn't there at the moment. Um, and this is listed under a weapons with my ship on the interactive menu but I don't know if it actually goes on it or whether this is just a simulation for target practice something like laser tag downrange and there's a, a funny bug when I get out of the chair I have no head my suit is a ghost but uh, I'm, I'm kind of interested to find out whether or not that gun's actually going to go on my ship because that would be amazing um, if not I know I can put one on there with an upgrade this box I'm not sure if it's a storage compartment or whether that's actually gear that will eventually be mine that I get to an exchange on and off as at will um, right now I can't. I can just open it up and look at it so I don't know what the plans are for it exactly in the future. This elevator is pretty cool but it leads you up to the second floor where you're in a protective chamber and I'm assuming this is basically for other people in your hangar that aren't going in flight with you because once you open up the cargo doors, I mean, theoretically, you'd be sucked into space, but 
Um, I don't know how realistic they're making this. I, I don't know if it's going to be a requirement that you be up here if you're actually in the hangar or you will die. Or whether uh, it just won't affect you at all and it's just for an observation room. Or rather an observation level. But this is my hangar. I cannot wait to play this game. I'm so excited for it. And I, I'm so impatient as it is. Uh, it's going to be hard to wait. I think there's uh, about a year and a half before releases are the predicted release date for this game. Um, I am really looking forward to testing it in alpha and beta stages as well. I hope you liked my video. Um, please subscribe and I'll keep you updated on the game as well as other games on my channel. And if you actually end up being a, a pledger, let me know and maybe we'll fly some missions together. Thanks for watching and until next time.